My name is Stacy Jensen and today I will be showing you how to use our beautiful firework overlay. So we're going to go into Photoshop with a, an original photo by Marie Moss. This image is absolutely stunning and perfect as it is, but Marie really wanted to add a little bit more flair and artsiness to it. The ring stands out, but she kind of wanted to draw more attention to it. So what we did is created a firework overlay that will be able to allow you to retain the original image, um, but simply add a little bit of light that is fun and also artistic. So I have both overlay, I have the overlay and the original open. So this is the Firework 8. Here we're going to place this on the image, but as you notice, uh, the light, as it is, is on the right side and we want to pull that in. So I'm going to show you quickly. You're going to click on the overlay that you want. You're going to get your Move tool. We're going to come into the middle of the photo anywhere, grab it, hold down your mouse key, come back over to the other photograph and drop it into the center of the image. You can also do this by going up to file and place. I usually have both of them open at the same time, but either way works the same. As you can see, it came in a different size. You can either keep it as this or um, increase the size of it. I'll show you how to do that, but first we're going to flip it. So what you do, we have the layer of the overlay selected. We're going to click on Edit, Transform, Flip Horizontal. You could also rotate it a bit, but we're going to flip it horizontal, which will mirror it, so that it's coming from the corner, as you can see. So now we're all set, and now we're going to transform it a little to make it a bit larger. Again, we're going to go up to Edit, Frame Transform, we're going to hold down our shift key, very important. This keeps it in proportion. And then we're going to drag it just bigger than our photograph. We come up to the top and hit the check mark. It places it. So now you cannot see the ring behind it. We're going to go up to normal. Again, we are on the layer of the overlay. We're going to go to normal and screen and we're all set. That is the only thing you have to do with these amazing overlays. I absolutely love it. It's just that, that little bit of flair that brings your attention right over to this diamond. So here is the before and here is the after. Absolutely works fantastic. You could also layer or lower the opacity of it to blend it a little more naturally, but I kind of love it at full blast on this one. So thank you so much for watching and look for our next overlay set coming very soon at colorbellactions.com.